In this exercise, we are going to publish an Exchange server for secure uh, Outlook Web Access. Right now, I'm in Denver. So in Denver, Denver is the domain controller and Exchange server. So you also can see that the uh, under the administrative tools, the certificate authority has been installed. All right, as you can see that this is a CA. So we are going to apply a certificate in our IIS and we are going to use the SSL. So first, let's launch our Internet Explorer. And let's go to the Denver Cert Server. This is our certificate authority. We are going to request a certificate. Select at one certificate request and create and submit a request to this CA. Remember, we need to apply the cert. Okay, so we click on the submit, leave everything as default. Select yes. And click on install this certificate. Click on yes so that the certificate will be installed in your computer. Close your Internet Explorer. Now next, we need to go to our IIS. So click on the administrative tools and select IIS. Expand the Denver server. You will have your website here and a default website. Right click your default website, click on the properties, and you're able to see the um, directory securities and we have the server certificate so a visit appear click on the next so we assign an existing certificate remember that early on we already applied a cert and installed a cert in our computer so assign an existing cert click on the next so we select the um, Denver Condoso.com. Next, you can see that the SSL port is 443. We use the default. Click next and next finally finish. So the certificate has been installed. We click on the OK. Next, we need to apply the cert to our directory on the exchange right click the exchange properties you can see there's a security directory security tab select edit we select require SSL click OK apply and OK so we also need to do it on our Exchange Web Virtual Directory. Click on the property. Do the same thing. Directory Security. Edit. Require SSL. And finally, the Public Virtual Directory. Do the same thing. Directory Security. Edit. And check on the Require SSL. Okay, so now all the uh, three uh, virtual directory, exchange, exchange web, and public already been assigned the SSL. Next, we need to go to the uh, foreign computer, which is our ISA server, to configure the rules. 